Hello and welcome to This Week in Pizza for the week of November 26. I'm Daniel Lee Perea. Domino's Pizza is among the many pizzerias that are putting out the call for help to beef up staff for the busy upcoming pizza season. Domino's franchise owners plan to hire up to 25,000 drivers, order takers, and pizza makers for the upcoming New Year's holiday and Super Bowl, which are among the busiest times of the year for pizza delivery. Domino's sent out a news release nationwide announcing their hiring goals, something other pizzerias, whether they are independents or large chains, might consider to get the word out. Local news outlets are always looking for stories, and a press release about how your business is helping the local economy is a great way to get your name and information to the public at no cost. Happy's Pizza teamed up with players from the Detroit Lions to give away 4,000 coats to needy kids. Happy's donated $75,000 to buy the coats for the big giveaway, which was sponsored by Greater Grace Temple Church. Detroit firefighters joined Lions running back Joeek Bell, linebacker Stephen Tulloch, and wide receiver Nate Burleson, who's still on crutches from a broken leg suffered in an October game against the Chicago Bears, to give out coats, talk to kids, and sign autographs. A long time war between two rival pizzerias is over. In a settlement reached between Eddie's Pizza in New Hyde Park and Emilio's Restaurant and Pizza in Comac, Emilio Branchinelli promised to stop calling his pizzas bar pies and also issued an apology to owner Joseph DiVittorio for allegedly badmouthing Eddie's Pizza. In a lawsuit filed in federal court, Emilio's is said to have attempted to use the moniker bar pies in 2003, but stopped when they received a cease and desist letter from Eddie's. Then recently they started using the name again. Bar pies have been the signature dish at Eddie's Pizza since the 1930s. Be sure to check us out online at pmq.com and follow us on Facebook and Twitter. For This Week in Pizza, I'm Daniel Lee Perea.